yeah, this is fucking GTA 5. Finally came out, sons. Me and Cody here grabbed it at the midnight release, and it's fucking dope. It's boss. Sick game. Playing as Trevor right now, and we're going to do a video talking about the driving physics of this game. Obviously, they made a huge... <laughs> Obviously, they made a huge change with the driving, and we're going to talk about that. So, buddy, grab yourself a vehicle, son. Look at this, baby. Coquette. <laughs> Coquette. Yeah, so if you haven't played this game yet, the driving physics and mechanics are way different than any other GTA game. And it's getting a lot of debate. Some people love it, some people hate it. Personally, when I first started playing this game, I hated driving physics, just because it was so much different. Like, as you can see, it grips to the road a fuckload. Whereas in GTA 4, it was really slippery. This game, they, they even said it feels more like a racing game than uh, than the previous GTA. Apparently they used a lot of the physics from uh, Midnight Club. Yeah, the, the newest Midnight Club Rockstar made. Oof. Clearly a lot of the physics were taken from that, and I like it now. Playing it a while, I like it. And uh, you can probably already tell it's a lot different. But it makes it easier to do like stunt driving. So like trying to thread the needle between two cars on the highway, you're going to... Boom, right there. If it was GTA 4, you'd try to correct a little, and it would overcorrect and lose control. That was the big issue with GTA 4. But yeah, fuck. Right now, uh, is there a place you're actually trying to go, or just you doing the driving? Oh, see, I just zipped through like 15 cars there. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, oh no. fuck. Where are we heading, Cody? Mount Chiliad. Oh, shit, son. So, yeah, going to Mount Chiliad. <laughs> the basic idea of this fucking video is to find out whether you like the fucking driving, the new mechanics of GTA 5 or not. A lot of people I've seen don't like it. They don't like the new driving. They don't like the new flying. They don't like the new anything. What do you guys think? Leave that shit in the comment section. Do it up. Personally, I like it. You like it, Cody? Think it's a lot better than GTA 4? At first, not necessarily. But there is like a driving skill between the characters. Yeah. That they have to develop. I think that's pretty important. Yeah. But then it becomes a lot more like me. That was just it, though. Making that transition between GTA 4 and this one was fucking... It was weird. Like, mm -hmm. when I first played that, that mission, trying to chase Lamar in that car, I was crashing all over the fucking place. And I was like, dude, the driving's fucked. And I didn't like it. But now that I've gotten used to it, going back to GTA 4 now would feel fucked. It would feel like you're on an ice rink. Because it was so slippery in that game. But yeah, so we're gonna drive all the way up Mount Chiliad just for the fuck of it. Mount Chiliad is such a sick GTA San Andreas reference. Right there. This game is full of fucking references. I, mean, I can fly up it right now, but we want to cool. drive up it. Let's see if we can find a motorcycle of some kind. Mm-hmm. Or an ATV. Another uh, huge uh, thing that what? GTA 4 had let down was no countryside. You were like searching so hard to find this little piece of fucking land to explore, but there was none. You'd find like the beach. Oh, you didn't like that the whole thing was the city? No, man, I hated that. I really missed the countryside in GTA 4. Oh. It wasn't there. Oh, yeah, the biker gangs hate Trevor, by the way. He pisses them off. Pretty early on, there's a huge uh, reference to another GTA game. But I won't spoil it. You gotta play this game in order to see it. You can't climb a mountain with that, dude. Uh, I'll try. <laughs> oh, he's gonna try and climb Chile out of the fucking heart. Once again, let us know what the fuck you think about the driving in this game. It's much more, uh, there's much more life in this game, too. Much more busy, much more dense, much more traffic. Oh, okay. Don't tell me that killed me. No. Oh, my God. Fuck you, spider. <laughs> All that. Go oh, he... Another good thing they did with this game was they took out that whole aspect of islands being fucking blocked off in the, bit, in the start of the game. Right in the beginning, you have the whole island unlocked. You just have to explore it and find it all. There's no stupid barriers holding you back. You can go wherever the fuck you want. And that's good. I think we're finally on our way up. Good video! Trains is another thing. Not like a subway, an actual train. Oh, the car's fucked already? No, it just sucks. <laughs> Coog. Oh, another fucking sweet thing about this game. Oh. <laughs> no. Another sweet thing about this game is there's fucking animals and shit. And animals that can actually kill you. Cougars and like mountain lions. I don't know if there's cougars. There's definitely mountain lions. Oh. Yeah. Kind of like the same animal. 
kind of. Kind of. There's so giant cats that kill you. That's all you need to know. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> yeah, this is a PS3 version of it also. I forgot to say that. Not the Xbox version. Come on, it runs on one disc on the PS3, and it was designed for the PS3, so... And people, a lot of people's complaints was the 8 gig install, but you know what, that really took like less than 10 minutes. Yeah, that wasn't a huge issue at all. That was like the fastest 8 gig install I've ever had or anything. That wasn't at all an issue. It was quick. Alright, yeah, that's the conclusion to our driving GTA 5 video. Let us know in the comments what you think about it. If you like it, if you hate it, what's good about it, what's bad about it, what can they improve on it, will they maybe fix it in the updates? Mmm. Never know, right? Probably not. This is I know you're right. This is an early version of GTA mm. 5. It's fucking brand new shit. If you haven't played it yet, get it, try it, love it, hate it. Let us know what you think. <laughs> oh yeah, and subscribe to the channel. And shit. This is dope. Peace.